Hey guys, welcome back to the English Gentleman Gamer with me, Roscoe. Just wanted to bring you a quick initial impressions video for the Battlefield 4 beta, beta that came out yesterday. I obviously play on the PS3, and I have to say I'm quite enjoying it. I'm not sure whether it's the fact it's just different maps, or it, the whole game just feels a little bit... Well, obviously feels a bit fresher. I do like that thing, by the way, where it shows you the guy who killed you in red. Um, it makes it that little bit easier to spot him, because obviously there's no kill cam like Call of Duty, so... You, does make finding the bastard that just nailed you that a bit easy to find. Uh, I'm not going to go too much into the graphics, other than I think they're pretty good. You know, for a machine that's pretty old now, I think Dice have done a pretty good job. That guy really should have killed me there. I've got one of them though, and his mate spawned right on him, unfortunately. Um, I would like to bring your attention, if you will, to the fact that the button layout is different. I mean, example, uh, prone, I seem to remember, used to be R3. Or is it's R three on Battlefield three? Um, R three now is knife. Um, spotting was used to be on select. It's now on R two along with the combo rows. Uh, getting in a vehicle, I swear, used to be circle or is circle on Battlefield three. It's now holding down square. Um, so there are a few things to pay attention to because I, I I had a lot of rubber banding unfortunately, but I'm not sure if it's actually my internet connection or the service so I won't like to say anything negative about them just yet um, yeah the button layout it's worth having a look at that before you start getting really stuck into it because I came a cropper a few times um, unlock wise there's not a massive amount to unlock in the beta and there's a couple of guns for each class in my experience the AK-12 I think it's called the default um, assault rifle thing or whatever is pretty good I do think this is the M I think this is the MX4 it's called and that's a fucking beast. I like the fact there's like a proper highlight now that there's a grenade around you. Um makes it that bit easier to dodge. So I'm not sure if there's actually any point to it, because obviously a grenade, you know, there's not a highlight comes up in real life or anything, but there you go. Um graphics wise, the textures pop quite a lot, but it's a beat you know EA have been or Dice rather have been at pains to tell us that this is quite an old build because it has to be submitted to Sony and Microsoft quite a long time in advance before it's approved, blah blah blah. So I won't worry about that. I won't worry about the rubber banding either. Um, I have to say, I think it looks, pre looks pretty good and plays pretty well on the PS3. To my knowledge, the first anyone clapped eyes on the PS3 build was when they started playing it yesterday. I don't remember ever seeing a PS3 video um, officially from Dice, so I think they've done a pretty good job personally. It's a lot of fun, but I mean, some of the fun comes from exploring the new maps. I don't, I fucking clue. That guy got me loads yesterday. Um, fucking clueless walking into that bullet. This respawn screen that you briefly saw there, there aren't any new options. You, you can still only spawn into either your own base, your squad mates, or um, a vehicle. But it is laid out a bit nicer, and it's a bit easier to tell where everyone is. Especially the vehicle side of it, because it actually you know, physically displays on the map. That guy should really got me as well. Um, it does show you on the map where the vehicle is rather than um, like a little mini cam thing it does in Battlefield 3. So I think overall the game's a bit easier. Obviously it's early days yet. I think the aiming, uh, the sort of gun control, certainly on this build, feels um, a bit closer to Bad Company 2. Uh, in my opinion, Battlefield 3, particularly on the PS3, the recoil was fucking outrageous. Um, Evidently, I was one of the few people who did actually struggle with that, though. This feels a bit more like Battlefield uh, Bad Company 2, in my opinion. The recoil is that little bit less, in my experience. Um, there you go, we won that round quite easily. So, just a few very initial impressions of the game. Uh, you know what? Hopefully, I'll see you all on the battlefield and you should crack on with the beta. I'll catch up with you soon. Thanks for watching. Bye.